All right, I'm back. Um, next up, I'm going to be showing you more of my cases. I decided to hold off on doing my ranking video until I get through this next display of probably two, three hundred cases or something. Um, yeah. 28 weeks later. I do have the first one, but it was also in this. Uh, it didn't say it was in it, but it was. Um, 30 days of night. Uh, that's a vampire movie, it looks like. Sounds cool. Then we have 127 hours. Deadpool spoils the end of this movie in, the, in Deadpool 1. So I don't think I have to. 300 and 300 Rise of the Empire. Of an empire, my bad. Um, I've heard those are good, ac good uh, action movies. Haven't seen them, but they sound pretty good. Prometheus, not as good as it, as it should be. Alien Covenant. This one is as good as it, as it could be. Not as good as it should be, but it is as good as it could. Alien, original. Can't beat that one. That one's good. That one's really good. Aliens. Builds on what you like about the first movie. Alien 3 doesn't have enough um, explanation as to how they got where they are. Um, is there a director's cut of this? I don't know. If there is, that would probably be better than, than that one. Alien Resurrection. This one I don't mind. It's, um... Pretty good. I think it was originally part of an anthology set, and so it's a disc seven. Alien vs. Predator. This is the uh, rated version. Um, only PG-13 in either franchise, and it, so it, I think it works just fine. But not everyone likes it. Requiem, Alien vs. Predator 2. This one was pretty good. Um, had more Alien and Predator Mayhem. Even a Predator-Alien hybrid. Which is pretty awesome looking, actually. And then, American Beauty. That one is, uh, strange. Yeah. First five seasons of American Horror Story. We got Murder House. Asylum. Coven. Interesting imagery on that. I started season three, but I didn't get very far. Uh, freak Show. I think the world's shortest woman is in that. And Hotel. I do have season eight, but it's a uh, Separated from these ones until I get season six and seven, which I'm not been, been able to find. Being able to find lately, American Made, based on a true lie. I think I mentioned it's based on a coke smuggling deal. That's why it's based on a true lie because he has to lie about about smuggling the drugs. Um, Uh, 
Yeah, many bell horror. There you go. Two thousand five version. Ryan Reynolds version. Almost famous. I might watch this one either tomorrow night or tonight. Actually, probably tomorrow night because I want to watch the original Purge tonight. Slightly chewed up or copy of our case for Olympus has fallen. London has fallen. Angel has fallen. I think they're making another has fallen movie soon. But yeah. Oh, there's that. Anna from 2014, 2013, something like that. This one is um, This one's kind of like a murder mystery, it looks like. This is a Spy and Espionage 2019 Anna. Um, Annabelle. I guess I need to watch these before the Conjuring trilogy. It's okay. I can do that. Creation. Does that one come before the original Annabelle? No. Annabelle comes home. And we have Air Force One. Apocalypse Now Redux. Argo. Atomic Blonde. And there's um, Barely Legal. That one's in my private collection. Um, I think I already mentioned what's up with that one. Uh, going into why it's called that. Uh, presents aren't the only thing they're unwrapping. Two more in my private collection are Basic Instinct. Anyone that has seen that will know why it's in my private collection. As is this. Basic Instinct 2. Uh, Basic Instinct 1 gets um, 
a shout out in Deadpool 2. Um, Blair Witch Project. Not as good as it could be. But still a good one. Blair Witch 2. Book of, Book of Shadows. Um, that one's my favorite of, of the three of them. Speaking of the third one. Blair Witch 2016. Kind of a reboot. Kind of a continuation. Um, yeah. Body Double. Kind of an interesting take on on a whodunit thing. Two copies of Book of Eli. I only have a case for one of them. And Braveheart. Butterfly Effect. This includes the um, extended director's cut, I think. Anyway. Butterfly Effect 1 and 2. Two movie collection. Same disc. And Butterfly Effect 3, Revolutions, Revelations, Revelations, okay. Carrie, three, three movie collection. You got one, two, The Rage, and the 2002 version. The 2002 version's not my favorite of the three. Um, the original is. The sequel's okay. This one's great. Original is great. This one's great. It's from 2013. And then we have... Um... Centurion. My dad got me that one. And we got... The original Child's Play. Child's Play 2. Child's Play 3. Child's Play 4, where Chucky's face now looks uh, stitched back together. 5. Seed of Chucky. 4 is Bride of Chucky. 6 is Curse of Chucky. Right there. He has a different haircut in that one, it looks like. Cult of Chucky. More than one Chucky in that one. Shouldn't get convoluted at all. And then there's the remake. This time it's about a an, an, uh, Wi-Fi and, and AI system. Instead of possession, which is, I mean, it still works. It's still a good movie. Um, and we got Closer. Confidence. Conjuring 1 and 2. Conjuring 1, 2, and 3. I know, I double dipped, I double dipped. The Creeps. Um, yeah. Don't know anything about that movie other than it looks like, um, Mummy, Frankenstein's Monster, Werewolf and Dracula, or Vampire King or something. Uh, 
Curse of Alarona. Is this one any good? I haven't watched any of the Conjuring movies except for The Nun yet. And that one was... It's good. Okay, I'll be right back. For you guys, it won't be very long for me, about two minutes. Dawn of the Dead and Land of the Dead. Devil's Own. And rounding out this, this, um, stack. Die Hard. And moving right along, we got Die Hard 2. Three, the vendors. Live free or die hard. Good day to die hard. And we got what is this? District Nine. Doomsday. Uh, double Jeopardy. End of Days. Enemy of the State. Only the DVD for Elysium. This one's pretty good. I think this is one of the Blum Camp movies. Been a while since I watched that one, but it's pretty good. Then we have the Equalizer one. I don't have the case for the second one, but I do have it. I have the disc for it. And then on DVD we have Ash vs. Evil Dead, Season 1. And on Blu-ray Steelbook. Steelbook. We have season two. Ex Machina. I should up upgrade that to, to Blu-ray. It's a good enough movie to do that. And then we have Exorcism of Emily Rose. That's a good story. Creepy, but good. We have Dominion, or no, Exorcist the Beginning, my bad. Next up is the other one. Dominion, sequel to the Exorcist. We have two versions of the original Exorcist. We have the theatrical version. And the version you've never seen. Only I've seen it now. That invalidated it. Heretic. Weak sequel. Um, yeah. Exorcist 3, Legion. As in Legion for We Are Many. 
and the Expendables trilogy on the same disc. And that's the end of the E's right there. For this section at least. And we got Fight Club. Can't talk about that. Or shouldn't. First rule about Fight Club. Don't talk about Fight Club. Final Destination 5 movie collection. Um, I like all of these. Um, creative kills, if you can call them kills, they're more like deaths. Because there isn't like a murderer or anything in them. Flash dance. Um, one of the songs in this is a lot of fun to dance to. Or a maniac. That's the song. Um. We're getting Sarah Marshall, two versions of the same movie. Um, so so. Freaky, very much enjoyable. Freddy's Nightmares Volume 1. Should I move those to be with the uh, Nightmare on Elm Street series? Would make sense. More the same volumes three and four. You know what? I am gonna do that. Freddy versus Jason. Freeway. Friday the 13th, parts 1 and 2. I'll be back with more. Friday the 13th, parts 3 and 4. Final chapter. But it wasn't. Uh, new beginning and Jason lives. New blood and Jason Arrives in Manhattan is a more accurate title. Never actually took over the place. He just died there in the sewer. Movie titles that don't make sense are a lot of fun. Jason goes to hell. Only a Voorhees can defeat a Voorhees. Jason X. Feels disconnected from the rest of the, the timeline. Friday the 13th, Killer Cut. This is the reboot. This one's good. I enjoy it. As uh, Jared Padalecki from um, Supernatural in it. Frozen. Game night. Um, all eight seasons of GOT. Um, And then animated um, thing for it. Not great. Girl on the train. 
Girl Next Door, Godfather Trilogy, Gothica, Good Luck Chuck, don't watch this with your family. And we have a bunch of Halloween movies. Two. Three. Not a Halloween movie, that one works, but as a Michael Myers movie, it's not a Michael Myers movie. Four and five. These are Michael Myers movies. Six. H two O. Rob Zombie. One and two. Resurrection. Twenty eighteen. And Halloween Kills. Uh, I enjoy most of those movies. I'm not too real big on uh, Season of the Witch, the third one. But I can get into that later. So, yeah. Animal Rising. Red Dragon. Silence of the Lamb. Hannibal, Manhunter, um, then rounding out the H's, we have Hansel and Gretel Witch Hunters. This was a pleasant surprise. Heartbreak Kid, Blonde Ladies, cool, Eat in the Street 8-pack, and it features License to Kill, Momentum, Spencer Pale Kings and Princes, Chance, Fresh, Glass Shield, Resting Place, and Spencer a Savage Place. Hide and Seek. History of Violence. I was watching this not too long ago. So it was off to a good start. Shoot 'em up movie. Um, Hollow Man. I'll have to give I'll have to check that one out. I haven't watched it yet. I think there's two of these. Um There's a trilogy that all take place in the same year, presumably. I know what you did last summer. I still know what you did last summer. I'll always know what you did last summer. I spit on your grave one and two. Or the original and the remake. The original's better in this instance. The remake had three sequels, so can't be that bad, can it? Inglorious Bastards. What order? Does, doesn't matter what order we watch the Tarantino movies. The only one I've seen is Pulp Fiction. Invisible Man. Good one. It. Good in its respects. It, chapter one. Much, much more entertaining than the original one, I feel. It, chapter two. Better yet. That's it for the eyes. 
And we have um, three J's, and they're all the same uh, same franchise. John Wick, great movie. John Wick 2, also great movie. And John Wick 3, Parabellum, great movie as well. Have you figured out what all of these movies have in common? Hmm. Kill Bill. Kill Bill 2. King of the Ants. As if they needed one. King's Speech. Kiss Kiss Bang Bang. Knock knock, I'll give you a hint of what they all have in common with this. Did you did you catch it? Did you catch it? Did you? Eh? Eh? Blu-ray of knock knock. Knock. Knock knock. Last house on the left. I think this is a remake. Um, it has both a rated and an unrated version, so that's exciting. Maybe I'll watch this tonight instead of Purge. I think, I, I think I'll do that. And we have Le Legends of the Fall. Leon the Professional with Natalie Portman's on screen debut. Lethal Weapon Trilogy. Those are the director cut versions. And four. Um, Richard Donner film. Oh, really? Interesting. Cool. Let's Scare Julie. That was a good one. Um. Rounding out the L's, we have Lucy. This one is about what would happen if, the, if humanity used 100% of its brain capacity. Long story short, we would turn into a supercomputer. We got a bunch of, of uh, Matrix movies. One reloaded revolutions and a matrix. All four of the ones I previously mentioned combined onto two discs and resurrections. I started this one, it was off to a good start, but I was tired while I was watching it, so I fell asleep. That's happened so many times. It's not even funny anymore. But... Those ones off to the side. And we got mirrors one and two. The mist. My Bloody Valentine, the remake. Solid remake. Never saw the original, but that one's really good. So, I like my original. Nightmare on Elm Street, classic slasher. Um, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street 2, Freddy's Revenge. Still pretty classic. Three. Dream Warriors, great movie. Uh, the Dream Masters, number four. Number five is Dream Child. Freddy's Dead, Final Nightmare, but it isn't. Because then there's this abomination. Wes Craven's New Nightmare. I mean, it's a good story, but I don't think it was done all that well. 
in the remake. Solid remake, actually. I, I, it gets a lot of hate. But I, I really like that one. Call me crazy, but I enjoyed it. And then, not another teen movie. Ridiculous, weird thing. Number 23. After watching that for a few days, you'll see 23 everywhere. But none. Old school. The Omen Collection. This has um, one, two, three in the remake. All on Blu ray. Open Water 1. Open Water 2. Adrift. And Paranormal Activity, the original. That one is so, so good. I really like that. Alright, next up we got Paranormal Activity 2. Paranormal Activity 3. Paranormal Activity 4. Paranormal Activity 5. And 6, the go marked ones in Ghost Dimension. For the first time, you will see the activity. And we have 30 Nights of Paranormal Activity with the Devil Inside the Girl with a Dragon Tattoo. Spoof. Patriot Games, Perfect Murder, the original Pet Cemetery, Pet Cemetery 2, and Pet Cemetery the remake, Phantom of the Opera with Robert England, Freddy Krueger himself. Tune can't really see it all that well. Predator, the original. Predator 2. Predator 3. Predators. Predator 4. Would have been a good time to bring back Arnold. They didn't go that route. And the Prophecy 5 movie collection with Prophecy, Prophecy 2, Prophecy 3, The Ascent, Prophecy Uprising, and the Prophecy Forsaken. Those last two I have two of, uh, Forsaken and Uprising. Psycho 4 movie collection. These ones are pretty good. remake not as good probably feel differently if I had watched that one first pulp fiction this see this imagery is never used in the movie but, and then we have the first purge the purge Purge Anarchy. Purge Election Year. With a slipcover. Rambo. 
form of the collection from the last bud. Ready or not. Killer game of hide and seek. Beautiful lead. Redemption. See how much I paid for it on the case there. Reindeer games. Reservoir dogs and a tall Blu ray case. Resident Evil. Resident Evil 2. This one's Apocalypse. Um, yeah. 3. Extinction. 4. Re de er, degeneration. And 5. Afterlife. Um, I think some of these are animated CGI. Resident Evil what, 6, I think. Retribution. Damnation. Vendetta. Final chapter. I think there's two more after that. Haven't seen them, haven't gotten them. Haven't seen only but the first one. And we got the Riddick series. Pitch Black, Chronicles of Riddick, and Dark Fury. Um, it says Dark Fury is only 35 minutes. It's so weird. Robocop Trilogy. And the PG-13 remake. Running Man. Satanic Rites of Dracula. Just saw movies. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And Jigsaw and Spiral. You would think, just judging from this, that Tobin Bell painted his face like that, but he didn't. It's just cover art. Scarface. Scary Movie 1, Scary Movie 2, Scary Movie 3, Scary Movie 4, Scary Movie 5, Scream 1, Scream 2, Scream 3, Scream 4 and Scream 5. Seven. Sex in the City, the movie. Shape of Water. The Shining. The Superior Shining. Dr. Sleep, Shooter, 